teacher is a very important part of my life. I am interested in microphobic detail of plants. By looking very closely, I found really beautiful details which I can use for my work. My name is Hitomi Hosono. I am a ceramic artist working in London. I was looking at a massive Hoson tree in Britain. It was really massive, but have a tiny flowers. I thought it's beautiful, and this coexistence of a small, delicate element and also big scale of the tree is wonderful, I thought. I wish to express this feeling with a porcelain piece. I really love to make something which is essentially from us. When bag of clay arrives in the studio, it's lifeless. But there is excitement going through the process. The clay starts taking its shape, and that is really exciting for me. Making something porcelain is frustrating if we don't know how to handle it. Porcelain is a very sensitive and delicate material, and if I rush the porcelain in my craft. But once we get the hang of it, it could be very therapeutic. Every day sometimes could be repetitive, but it's like the therapeutic and meditative. As I touch the material, more memory comes back through hand. And I remember in Gifu Prefecture in Japan, there are lots of rice fields and in the hot summer night, thousands of uh, frogs singing, and also the sound of rustling rice leaves fill the air. When I'm working in porcelain, this beautiful sound, I hear as if I was in Japan. It might take one month to complete one sprig model. Afterwards, I made negative mold. Then I put the porcelain clay inside of the mold, made thousand leaves from it, and then carve finer detail with modified dentist tools. I get a strong piece from potter's wheel. Then I apply these leaves on the shape. It almost looks like the leaves obscuring the branches. Then I dry uh, very slowly, sometimes takes six, seven months. And then some of the vessels uh, I gill inside with fine gold leaf, then it's finished. Sometimes whole process takes one year and a half. This needs patience. So I made this quietly at the studio, basically, this piece audience was only me for two years. But now the piece could be seen by a lot of people in Tefaf. I feel really grateful and excited. We Japanese have this phrase, seishin ga yadoru. Seishin means spirit. Yadoru means home. I believe each plant, each tree flowers have a Seishin, almost like us, they can think, they can feel. So when I'm making the porcelain piece inspired by nature, I feel this spirit, Seishin, exists in my piece. So this way, I also have this respect to the piece. That's the uh, attitude I have to the nature. 精神が宿る。